Hi everyone, my name is Ben. Uh, this class is for running the processing language. So processing.org, this is main uh, official website. So today is the first class. So I'm going to introduce what is this language and uh, how to download the development environment too. So this class today will be sure. Let's do it something. So what is the processing languages? You can see some explanation here, right? So you can see this word, visual art, or visual artist, or media artist, which means media artists use this language to make their own artwork, draw something. Which means this language is really easy to run. The programmer doesn't need to run this language. If you run already JavaScript or C or Java, Python, you can go ahead, you can do it right now. It is so simple and easy. The second reason that I recommend you this language is really fun to use this language to draw something. I'm going to show you. So let's go to this website, which is openprocessing.org. So you can share your own code on this website, or you can browse. You can see others code here too. There are so many examples. It's really good to do to you, you look at some of the code to learn that, that kind of programming. So let's choose one of them. So let's choose this one. If you click some of them, you can see it works, which means it shows it draws something on your screen. It's like a web program, right? Actually, it's really easy to uh, port, uh, transfer your own code to web using this process language. And if you click this one, you can see the source code using the process language. It's less than 20 lines, right? To draw this thing. Isn't it fun? So, uh, I'm going to tell you how to download this language environment. So, come to this site. I'm going to write down this URL address below the video clip. So, if you come here, you can see many links here, right? Uh, I'm going to tell you later. So just click the download link. Actually, uh, currently the up-to-date newest version is 4, but I think there is some bugs here. So I recommend you download the previous old version. So come down a little more. So you can see 3.4.5.4, right? So if you are uh, using the Windows computer, you can click here, or Mac or Linux, just click something based on your computer environment. So I'm going to download Windows 64. So if you download this one, you can see the zip file here, right? The thing is, you don't need to install this one. You, you only need to extract and copy the extracted file to somewhere that you, uh, that you like. So I'm going to see this file and uh, show in folder. So so this is zip file, right? So just extract this one. I'm going to tell you once again, you don't need to install, just extract it and copy the extract files to somewhere else that you like. Okay. Mm. Yep, it's done. So, so Actually, is this is the folder, right? If you go into the folder, you can see this folder. If you click once again, you can see this file and folder, right? So come back here. So I'm gonna copy. I'm gonna move these folders that I like, right? So right click and copy. So I already copy that. So this is drive C, C drive. So this is the file that I copied already. So you have to download the processing environment and extract that and copy somewhere else. That's it. You don't need to install it. So if you double click this folder, you can see this file and folders, right? Among these things, you can, you need to use this one. So processing.exe, just double click it to run it. So I'm going to use, I'm now using the um, Windows operating system. So you can see these things. After downloading this one, I'm going to show you just one line of statement, right? To draw the ellipse, 
can use ellipse function and where do you want to draw the ellipse? How big you want to draw that? I'm going to tell you later all these things. So after coding something, you can press the play button, right? Just play it. Then you can see, oh my god, it was shown uh, my other this. Oh, I, I'm not using the external monitor, so this is, is the uh, canvas which draw the ellipse. It's really easy, right? So from next class, I'm going to introduce how to use this environment, how to code using processing language too. So see you soon. Bye.